I love all bitches! Scepter and level, never mind. Well, I wouldn't have gotten the level, but same. There we go, last fucking chest to loot. 77 thieving. I think I was pretty close to the level, but goddamn. Four more levels to go till thieving takes a nice jump in experience. What was that, like 78 thieving last clip? And of course that would happen, but here we go. Bam! 82. Thieving, baby. I did a whole bunch of thieving. I just did like a five hour live stream or something. Bam! 76 cooking. Got two levels since, and my thieving levels is just about to hit 79. Had to do a few AFK things. I had this clue scroll in my bank for a long time, and I'm so bad with clue scrolls I didn't even bother looking at it, but it requires these two items. Like, as if. Like, what the fuck? So I had to drop it, but. So now that I can go ahead and make myself some blue dragon hide, which is gonna be. Oh man, look at this upgrade! Ah, I'm pretty sure you need this shit for a clue scroll actually as well, but who cares? We're a beast. We can craft our own shit. Look at that. Bam. This also means that we can now say... Bye. Bye. And our first loot is going to be the top. That shit took me like five tries to get the first time, but now I memorize like where to stand and everything. So this should be easy as shit. Let's see if I can drop this game's necklace and come back in time to pick it back up. Hopefully no one takes it though. Somebody took it and the guard got me as I was finishing off. I don't know how to like avoid the guard. I don't know if you can. Are you supposed to like wait around or some shit? Or do you just kind of YOLO it? I have no idea. It only takes a minute to run through. I'm not going to use any energy pots because it takes like two seconds to get back there. But some bitch did actually take my game's necklace. Like, fuck you. I don't know. I've never done this in my life before, so if I'm making a mistake and you get all pissed at me in the comments, go fuck yourself. It's my first time doing it. I think it might just be RNG, but I, I got through the first time, and I'm not doing anything differently this time. I'm just not getting through, so. Yep. No. Oh, I think I figured it out. You're supposed to use that little weird shit on the yard. I did not know that. I was wondering why the fuck that shit was there. God damn it, I could have been done by now. This is so pathetic. I'm so shit. Ooh, that sounds really loud. I really wonder what Gmod decided to make this amazing content, to be honest, though. Alright, much easier with that shit. The fuck is this? Is this not a piece? Uh, eh. why is that even a thing? Who designed this fucking fire? Then they probably already quit the game because this is 10 years old content update. Thank you. This is the part I love. You would think, hmm, traps. Nope, never mind. I'm a beast. All right, here we go for another kit. I don't even. Does it matter which one I loot? I don't. I hope it doesn't. <gasps> it does. <laughs> Officially hate this game. Why did you try something different, Al can you piece of shit? The current one I was using was working. Who the fuck that- Ah, oh, there's a trap at the ending, really, bro? Uh, this reminds me of, like, Tarn's Lair. I don't know if I'm saying that right, but you guys know where those little annoying things are? The little, yeah, those things that drop your prey in that room? I did it recently in this video, or last video, I forget, where you get the salve in with E-thing. That shit down there, those tear dogs, that, like, if you- there's, like, a tunnel down there. And if you've ever gone through it, it's the most AIDS thing ever. But um, this is a, this reminds me of exactly that. This is some old ass annoying mechanics. I don't know if I want to make a guide on this. I mean, obviously that kind of just fucked up. But that was just an honest mistake. I didn't know that. But very easy to go through this once you do it a few times. You just memorize it if you have at least an IQ of a thousand, and that's me. All right, I'm, I'm gonna get the right one this time. It's this one. Fuck that one. Don't touch that one. What? What? Watch! Watch! Is that part RNG? Or is there a way where I can know which one has a- Fuck this shit! Awful content. Would not recommend. Preferred to buy my shit off Treasure Hunter for the outfits. Thank you. Alright. Don't fuck me over. Is there any way I can tell? Ah, boy. Ah, boy. Examine. There's a trap here, dumb bitch. I wonder what it's inside. Yeah, I wonder what the fucking traps are gonna do to me underneath. Give me! No, what the fuck am I doing wrong, man? 
This ain't funny no more, Jax. No games. No fucking games. Just give me a fucking piece, bro. <gasps> no. No. Remove this. I am not happy right now, mate. I've used more energy potions trying to do this than I have this entire time I made this fucking account. This is so AIDS. Why Why is it gotta be RNG? Why is it gotta be a fucking hate RNG? This is supposed to be a skill. There's no fucking RNG in skills, you piece of shit. Mama, ma give me the boots. <laughs> it's a big ass ugly looking big. Hey. Fuck this game anyways. I honestly got some tears in my eyes just to know that I'm done with that bullshit. Oh god, I'm never doing that again. Time to try out Arty Nights and hate the living hell out of it because I'm gonna probably fail non-stop. And then I'll go back to Pyramid Blunder. Alright, good deal. Look at this. Boom! 10 kit. Yeah, I thought I failed. I'm in love with the Coco. Look at this XB, bro. Yeah, that was pretty good. Shit. Look at that, 70. I love getting level 70 skills. You Lombos are beautiful. I also got myself a thieving level, 84. As you can see, this is always where I bank when I do Pyramid Plunder to get my HP back up and shit, but 70. Let's go, four levels till 1500. And here we go, quest complete. I don't know why it said I needed a good bow, but yeah. Holy shit, that actually might be a range level, I'm pretty sure. Yes, red shins, that's all I needed, it was 55, nice. I'm too lazy right now, but this basically marks this quest right here, I believe. Perfect, look at that shit. Ya yeah, boy! Oh my god. Yes! <laughs> yes! Oh! Here's gonna be a voice crack and a very nerdy ass achievement, but getting 87 Thieb, but nonetheless, 1500 total level. Damn, that looks fucking good. The recording of this date, this account is exactly, I just put a day or two off of being a month and a half old. So, yeah, about 45 days. Anyways, this scepter is fucking beast. I am so happy I got it. Don't have to worry about which doors it is anymore. I don't have to worry about worrying, like, where the hell it is again. Because you got to remember, obviously, where they are. But, um, yeah, I'm pretty happy about this, man. Fucking nerd as shit. Anyways, goal is currently to still get one more of these things. One for, I guess, uh, like, clue scrolls in the future. If I decide to do them. Uh, and, obviously, if I want to do more pure and plunder. And the other one is going to be for the altar in the house, which is months away but we'll eventually get there i might still do a little bit of the knights or is it yeah the knights and arty um but i'm not too sure i don't really like the method at all because it's really like it's not afk at all to me and obviously if i'm on other accounts like every time i gotta click away um i will lose thieving xp because you have to constantly click uh, which is why a lot of people auto click it though i won't lie lately i haven't really been wanting to thieve at all which is why i went mining for a little bit and did some dailies on our stream i'm actually very close to 79 now as well might just bust out 80 sometime soon it's very easy to get that's going to be like seven more hours roughly this guy says seven hours of mining is going to be very easy but yeah 95 thieving thieve the knights without ever failing which would be pretty nice probably and then 99 with the cape i'm gonna be hitting up those farmers getting the rain our seeds and going straight back to slayer I'm gonna go straight to 99 Slayer probably. I have no need to do anything else. All the peapots I want. I got the bracelets ready for Slayer. Um, I guess I don't have things like Ancient Unlocked, which I'll probably want to have that unlocked for uh, Dust Devils, I guess, in the future. And it's probably it. And maybe Abyssal Demons, like I said. But anyways, let's continue thieving. Gonna hopefully be, uh, I don't know when I'm gonna hell I'm 88. I might actually leave Pyramid Plunder pretty soon and go do a few more things, but let's go. So I decided to go ahead and do a little bit of the Hardy Knights, and I, know I should probably move over here, but I'd like to, there we go. Um, there is a, right, 30 million overall experience, pretty damn sexy, currently just doing this method for a little bit of GPs, and no, I'm not doing it with my foot. But this is definitely a big difference since, uh, from what I've noticed, like I was doing this like level 84, I think, for a little bit, and I got stunned a fuck ton, but 
I came here at 87, and I, like, I'm not failing that much at all. I've gotten this much GP in almost like an entire, like, yeah, almost an Envy. So I probably have like 200,000 GP by the time I finish this Envy, which is almost a full hour. So that's pretty damn good. Before, I used to go through an inventory in like 10 minutes. And that's a mining level. Holy shit, that's a long time, lady. Here we go. Bam. 88 thieving. Got like, what, seven more levels to go till I don't fail Arty Knights anymore, so not too bad. Damn, I'm getting some gains on this bitch. Tell me how sexy I am. Tell me how sexy I am. 89. Yeah. Thank you for watching the video. You made it to the very ending. Well, I would like to thank you for the support. And if you want to watch the last episode, it'll be on your left, homies. No, wait, it'll be on your right. Ooh.